She keeps the pressure on. The next one might do it. Uh, Bailey is down under pressure. Bailey looks to be well measured right now. And now Bailey's being measured. Counted it just in time. Oh. Slap. Look at that. She is showing us something special here tonight. On the apron, what's Bailey looking for? Hung across the middle rope. She heads out, but this one can be lost by count out. Big boom, vicious. Ooh. And elusive Bailey there. was about as lopsided as they come.
I am so glad to see you. The whole vibe you've got going on lately? With that build up, I'm more scared than excited, but go ahead. Last night, I was reflecting on my many successes and how I can multiply those successes. Wow, into... hard pass. No, 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 no. Not like hook up, hook up. I mean, we can let the rubes think what they and want. And that ally. Exactly. Would... Yeah? Well, maybe I could be out there for support just to put a little toe in the water. A little Sammy baby toe in there, just to check the temp. I guess it couldn't hurt, but I want to be clear, this is purely platonic. Great! See you there. No longer in someone else's shadow, this wrestler has a bright future. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making her way to the ring, accompanied by Sami Zayn. Here comes trouble. A superstar who is home. I know there's action going on in the ring, but all I want to know is what is Sami Zayn doing at ringside? If everyone's this confused, it's working. Whatever the reason. Oh, man. Good kick. She saw it coming. One reversal after another. These two are reading each other's minds. Beautiful arm ringer applied. Leg Larry with the arm wrench. Very nice. That offense taking a toll on her. Yeah, but too soon to be worried. Watch the quickness on this. Into the snap suplex. Oh, it didn't go as planned there. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Oh my god, a close line. And now Dakota is feeling heavy pressure. Kai's having trouble getting her bearings. Ooh. Ooh. Answer with a shot right to the face. Reciprocating the initial reversal. And some effective offense with that one. Ooh. Into the corner. This can't be good. Dakota Kai looking for a little real estate to work with. Here she comes. Beating it right back with a reversal. Big boot. Vicious. And now she's bringing in overwhelming offense. She's executing on her plan perfectly. Ooh. Have you seen the web? The buzz is a buzzin'. People are debating, hating. It does seem like everyone's talking. And they're assuming things. We need to let- What? 
No. Let people keep guessing. That's how... We people, won't, Sammy! But the WWE Universe doesn't know that. Point is, we They're can... They're actually married. Are they? Or is that just what they want you to think? We'll never know. I'm just saying maybe... Fine, can... but only so you shut up about this. And maybe because I do appreciate... Friends and allies can use heart emojis, too. A rare sight these days to see this superstar by herself. Yeah, I thought she and Sami Zayn were glued at the hip. Look out! Looks like Liv Morgan has caught her alone and is taking advantage. This fight is getting started before they even make it through the curtain. Everyone get out of the way. These two are abandoning all restraints. And that was a well-executed attack. Wow! Man, just a multitude of strikes. Oh, that can shatter a jaw. Good night. Boom, boom, persistent barrage. Oh, smashing the jaw. Vicious, aggressive attacks. Boom, right to the jaw. Oh, oh you can pick up your teeth in section 112. Brutality. She's staying elusive. Series of reversals. Oh, ho, ho, good night. Sorry. Watch the quickness on this. Whipped over in a snap suplex. Oh, using the knee. She's got an answer for that. These two trade encounters and... Oh, forget about pandering to the WWE Universe. That should keep her head in the game. Comes crashing down. Man, strikes. Wow. Big overhand. Morgan timed that one well. Oh, the jaw getting rattled. No. Hit. It's Bang. a super kick. <laughs> Liv is reeling in real danger now. Here it comes. Special delivery. Attitude adjustment. Here's a combo of strikes. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Oh, my goodness. Just strike it at will. What a shot. We've already seen a few shots delivered up in that region. Good night. And that was a concentrated attack to the leg. Oh, rocking the jaw. Big boot. Vicious. Avoiding contact. Oh, my God. Man, just a multitude of strikes. Ow. Knee right to the face. Oh, look at this. Arm wrench. Beautiful Ooh. back kick. Ooh, just relentless. Boom, boom. Persistent barrage. She's able to get out of the way. Dumped face first. Face breaker. Face breaker. Lights out, DDT connects. Elbow smash! There's a snap mare delivered and goes down low with the drop kick. Slips out of the way there, what reflexes? And it's another attack above the shoulders. Gotta protect that re... No official needed here, as it looks like...
was great, huh? You've got some nerve coming up to me after ambushing me like that. Just trying to convince you to leave my fake boyfriend alone. Duh. But Sammy is my fake boyfriend. Wait, what am I saying? I figured out what you and Sammy are trying to do and I want in. You're getting so much attention. So I decided that your fake relationship made me fake jealous. And you real attacked me? Sammy said you'd be chill with it. Of course he did. You know he's married, right? Of course. I don't want a real relationship any more than you do. Ew. You have some serious- Sorry, sorry. I meant to give you the heads up. Unfortunately, Liv found you before I- I'm over this- No! Thing. Don't leave me! Especially now when I've just set you up- You want Liv and me of to- Of course I do! What do you think? I'm above flipping antiquated gender norms? I don't think you're above anything. Right? Personally, I wanted to be on a pole for the match, but that's where management drew the line. You'll just have to settle for me being in your corner when you fight. I'll do the match, but if I win... All's I'm... fair in love and WWE, but don't expect Liv to play nice. She's almost as into the attention... It's the second generation superstar who's here to write her own. There truly is a lot to unpack in this one. We've got the continued presence of Sami Zayn acting as, I guess, a manager. Coming off a backstage attack by Liv Morgan with rumors swirling behind her motivation. Liv's motivation is love, Michael. And love makes you do crazy things. I just can't understand why any woman would be fighting over a man who looks like old chewing gum you find under the couch. But nonetheless, here we are. Arm ringer applied. And so accurate. Hoist it up. Snap suplex. to figure this out. Yeah, Liv's defensive instincts need to kick in. Oh, kick right in the face. Shoulders are down! Cover here. Oh, this, look, at this is blatant cheating. Yeah, she probably knew that cover wouldn't do it. Bam! <laughs> Arm ringer applied. And beautiful back kick. Beautiful sent on. She might be in some trouble now. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. She manages to get control. Big boot. Vicious. Look at her grabbing the momentum here. She is exposing all the cracks in her competition's game. These two having an answer for everything. Liv holds her. Big punch. Ouch. Beautiful arm ringer applied. Big Larry with the arm wrench. Very Nice. That's a few times now she's taking a hit up in that region. Oh, look at this. German suplex. And not done yet. Another German. Continuing to punish their opponent with a German. Well, if there's one thing people say about me, it's that I am a man of my word. Good. And for the record... I mean, for now. 
People are really invested in us, and so right. Few... Whatever. You know I'm not one to gossip, except when I hear what superstars say when they don't realize they're still on mic. Indy Hartwell and Lacey Evans were talking about you, and Indy was all, I don't reckon her finisher is all that strong. And Lacey said, I don't know about that, Indy. It's the superstar who's driven to live up to all the hype. Andy Hartwell takes on what happened to the tag team champs in a rarely seen finisher match. Yeah, there's rumors that Indy Hartwell has been saying that her finisher is substantially better than anyone else's, which led to this unique stipulation here tonight. Everyone always thinks their moves are the best. And if you don't, well, then that's a problem. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Ooh. Reversal from Hartwell. Back elbow smash, nothing fancy. Targeting the neck, right after the neck. <laughs> Matt Slam with some attitude. A snap man. Able to evade. Big boot. Vicious. She's taking some big hits here. She can withstand the punishment, though. the perfect match never any doubt
Hey, I'm, I'm working on something. I don't know if you'd have any interest, but... Why are you always trying to cause trouble, Sonia? Somehow, I don't think what I, I'm... I'm not being mean. Why do people keep thinking I'm trying to start something when I'm just Sorry, trying to... it's just your wording, your attitude. Whatever. Look, we may be WWE superstars, but I want to give back by putting on a show specifically for up-and-coming talent. I'm working with LAW to set that up That does sound like a good thing. I'd set you up against an indie wrestler, Geneva Rose, and maybe I just like helping people. Obviously, I need work on letting... Honestly, I'm still totally skeptical of Great. Wait, awesome. are you doing this for a tax?
Thanks for doing this. I'm happy to give someone a beat down anytime, any place. And if this one inspired some up and I'm glad to hear that because you just earned yourself a match against Odyssey Rift. I'm not trying to win an LAW title. Are you sure you don't want the match? I have to be honest. After getting a taste of being a WWE official, the before. power to broker match. the power to run LAW and turn it into a legitimate rival of WWE. I'm happy on SmackDown. Who knows? But I'm willing to bet WWE. I won't. didn't. <laughs> the only thing you didn't do was read that paper. That's I... fraud. Hmm, Good sounds... luck enforcing. I doubt I'll have to enforce anything once Odyssey Rift finds out you're refusing. I don't to... have time for this, Sonia. I did your. And there's one half of the tag team champions who's building a very impressive start to her career. Who is that? I think that's Odyssey Rift, but she's not signed with WWE. What's this all about? And things have seemingly gotten out of hand backstage. No time to wait for a bell to ring. This thing's disintegrating into a backstage brawl. Rights and lefts, elbows, knees, all of them lethal. Brutality. Big boot. Vicious. Man. Strikes! Oh, right to the jaw! Brutal boot! Oh, man! Ah, oh, gets cracked by the overhand. She avoids the attack completely. Every maneuver being returned with counter fire. Look out! Arm ringer applied and oh, kick to the face. Oh my God. Ow. Oh, strong impact. Oh my. An agile escape. Big boot, vicious. That's a few times now she's taken a hit up in that region. Fine uppercut. That'll cost some teeth. And there was some force on that move. Schoolboy, no, nope. nope. rolls through. Five. Five. Super kick. Slowly getting up, but she won't like what she's met with. That was brutal, but it looks like this brawl's over now. Looks like someone made Odyssey. Rift. I know you snuck her into the arena, Sonia. And you crossed the line. You really think you can come out to What are you going to do? Tell on me? Don't forget, I'm not the only wrestler under contract with LAW now. That contract you tricked me into signing is not in <laughs> I'm not worried about any legality. As long as I have Odyssey Rift as my enforcer, she's not going to let this go until you face her in the ring. On Either what condition? Make it a your hired match. What? It's like a your fired match in reverse. Loser has to sign a real ironclad contract with LAW. I'm confused. I thought you- I do, but I want rid of you too. And I don't intend on losing. When I beat you, the new contract you sign with LAW will be exclusive. <laughs> You're pretty cocky when you want to be, huh? <laughs> and I can't wait to watch you sign your-
could have seen me. OMG, look who it is. One half of the women's tag team champions. Hello to you too, partner and fellow tag team champion. Hey, we've been over this. I didn't hate you. Ah, yes, totally different. But speaking of, as champions, how should we? Why not hold an open challenge? Seems a good way to show- I the love it. Okay. Yeah, I regretted it as soon as I said it.
Oh, get ready, guys. There ain't nobody meaner than Tamina. They are ready for battle. The following contest. The former tag team champs refuse to go away. You have to expect them answering the champion's open challenge like indestructible villains in a horror movie. A horror movie we've seen too many times. I think I speak for the WWE Universe when I say it's time for a new era in tag team dominance. Will Asuka and Tamina regain their tag team titles from the new champions? Or will the champions kick off Corey's new era in tag team dominance? It's time to find out. Beautiful arm ringer across. The challenger eating up some damage. She's reached a critical point in this match, Cole. It's up to her if she wants to play it safe or keep fighting. Anything Asuka is trying is being suppressed. This has to be a bit demoralizing for the Empress. Her back in from ringside. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Able to capitalize on Ava's mistake. Unloads with the boot. Big knee to the midsection. thrown back into the ring. Monster set up in the corner. Here's a tag. Opponent off the ropes. Big back body drop. Arm ringer applied. Oh, right to the face. Dropping down all their weight. 
catching himself in the ropes. <laughs> Good night. What a stunner. The champ will stay champ. is the Bellas made quite an impact here tonight with their shocking return. We haven't seen them in quite some time, and now they just cut to the front of the line for a tag team title opportunity. Don't ever underestimate the Bellas cutthroat mentality. There's a reason they're Hall of Famers. I don't think the tag champions will be underestimating them after this. I love the Bellas twins, but y'all gotta take me like that. I didn't realize you were here tonight. Uh, last minute podcast business. Sorry for not giving you a heads up, but I'm glad I was here. It's just like the Bella Twins to show up and ruin everything. You okay? Yeah, and it sounds like you have something in common. They're also upset about never having the chance to compete for the tag championships. Don't say that. I have nothing in common with them. Those two ran me out of WWE. Didn't your injury run you out of WWE? My injury just sealed the deal. When the Bella Twins arrived, it was the beginning of the end. Suddenly, no one was interested in the women as athletes and competitors. They started telling me I was supposed to be a diva. You should be thankful you don't have to deal with that. I still don't know if that's exactly the Bella Twins' fault. I wonder if you'd feel that way if your matches kept getting bumped for bikini contests or schoolgirl matches, or pillow fights. The Bellas may not have been the whole Divas division, but they were a big part of building it. I see your point. I want to be a real competitor too. It must have been infuriating. Did I ever tell you I was supposed to give a retirement speech? After I found out I could no longer compete, I was going to have the chance to go out on Raw and have a proper farewell. I really wanted to thank the fans for supporting me throughout my career and tell them firsthand why I had to leave. So what happened? It was cut for time. WWE decided to cover the Bellas going on a double date instead. Wow, I'm so sorry. I never had an issue with the Bellas, but knowing that definitely puts them in a different light. And I'm certainly not a fan of what they did to us tonight. I'm not going to let Nikki and Bree push us around. You know, WWE has been requesting that I book the Bella Twins on ruthless digression so they can do press on their various frivolous projects. I blew them off because of, well, everything. But maybe it would be a good idea to set up an interview. It would be a real shame if anything happened to them while they're recording in the studio. I understand what you're saying. Anything can happen in a podcast studio. And it won't be a pillow fight. I'll talk to Ava. <laughs> 